Yeshu. I have come here to represent the 11th group. We are four in our group, two candidates and two, um, two brothers. We have started our prayer section with, uh, with the graceful starting with the hymn of Holy Spirit, Pavana Atma Andriyami. After that song, we were in silence for a few minutes. And after a candidate knelt down before us and we had prayed for her for three or four minutes. And after she had taken her seat, we asked her, I, have, I heard a vision. It was the face of Jesus. And uh, one brother had also another, an, uh, an another vision. It was, um, he asked her, do you have any problem or any something related with your family? And she suddenly said that my mummy has that problem because it was started not uh, from far, only from a few day, few months before. Uh, when she had gone for her vacation, uh, she felt that and her sister had said that her mother is um, acting as abnormal. And the great thing was Brother Anthony had done that after um, after that sharing, he had prayed for her and for her mother and for her family and it, um, he, ha he had taken that courage to pray for her. It was very inspiration for me and I congratulate Brother Anthony and after the next person and we have prayed, uh, it was me, they had prayed for me and after I was taken that seat, they asked me, uh, one asked me, do you have any fear? Do you have any fear affecting in your life? And I said that I am fearing darkness and also I am fearing ghost. And if I am alone, I will uh, fear in darkness. And uh, if somebody is with me, there is no problem for me. And uh, another candidate asked me, do you have any temptation or any inclination in your vo uh, vocation life? And surely I, uh, sudden uh, reply was that, Surely, 100% it is there because I, loved, I, loving, I am loving my mother very much, that much I am loving so that that attachment is there still now also. Sometimes, um, some thoughts, it will be coming in my mind. My body will say that it is not the suitable place for, place for you so that you have to be lived from here. And But something will be hindering me, something will be holding me in my hand that I understood now it will be Holy Spirit or Mother Mary and to the third person uh, Brother Anthony we had prayed for him for two or three minutes and we have asked that I have asked that do you have any problem in your family or to your family members and suddenly he said that he does not have any problem but uh, actually he is not that much calling to his family he is not phoning that much to his parents it is not a problem, he said like that. And another candidate asked him, do you have the instability of taking a decision? He said that 100% he had that. Sometimes he is unstable to take, take good decision. Some decision will be, uh, what we can say, falling down. It will not be suitable for him. It was his reply. And the fourth person, it was a can candidate, we had prayed for her and um, the vision was, I go, do you have any problem in your, in your family or um, in your, um, with your parents or with your relatives? Suddenly she had said that, don't have any problem, but my mother is um, searching for a job so that she has to find a job. And after finishing all the sharing, Brother Anthony himself taken that courage to pray over all of us intercession. All of us had shared our own intercession and we had prayed over them. It was a beautiful experience for me. And at last, as I'm concluding this sharing, I think to share this one also. St. John chapter 14 verses 70 says that, this is the truth, spirit of the truth whom the world cannot receive because it neither see him nor knows him. You know him because he abides with you and he will be in you. 
If we realize the Spirit of God is in us, we can see Him and receive Him. So, the anointing of the Holy Spirit, if we really recognize and understand in our uh, lives, it will be a graceful experience for us. Thank you.